Joe Beermaster here. I'm gonna we have a 2016 Dodge Durango. I'm gonna show you where the fuse box locations are. Now there's a cutoff at certain years. This year has a single power center that's located under the hood. I'm gonna show you where that is. Some of the older models all have a power center under the hood and also one on the inside of the cab. I'm gonna show you real quick. So I don't know if it's 16 and up. I don't know exactly what the cutoff is. You're going to have a fuse box here under the hood on the passenger side. You open it up by pulling these clips back and pull up. And there's your fuses. And if you look underneath the lid, there's a template that shows you what the fuses are for. You can match it up. Now I checked with the owner's manual on this one. It's the only one that's indicated for this model. But if you have a different model, some of the older ones will have a secondary fuse box. On the older model, this fuse box might be on the other side. Sometimes it's two fuse, fuse boxes next to each other on the other side. And then there would be one in here, down here, where you place your foot. There's a little box in here, a little slide. This one doesn't have it. You can see that. So some of them have that. But the OBD2 computer hookup port is located under here. And I'm going to show you where that is. If you look right there, there it is to hook the OBD2. That's typical for all years. So that's it for this. That's where the fuse boxes are. On the newer models, you have one under the hood. The older models, you'll have two side by side and one on the inside. So that's it, Joe Beer Master. I hope this helps you. If you like the video, please subscribe and give me a thumbs up. Take care.